My family's always been in construction and I've always thought that was fascinating, but I wanted to do it myself. I didn't want help. I wanted to grow from the bottom up. I've always thought about going to college, but I like being outside. I like working with my hands. And for me, I just wanted that experience that way. And I saw these houses going up across the street from me and I walked over and I asked for a job. It's kind of crazy <laughs> to say I did that, but I love seeing things get built from the ground up. I get up around 4.30 every morning and I'm really just thinking about the schedule of how construction is going to go that day and the look ahead. And the crews come in typically around 6.30 and then we start permitting and go over safety topics and things like that for the day and then we go over the schedule of what's going to happen that day. This facility, it's a soybean facility and it's a farm to table plant. Um, we take the soybeans in and they go through a flaker and extraction process and we make several types of oils. To see the entire process of the bean coming in off the rails from the farmers directly that are local and then out going to the stores and facilities and people in general, that to me was really neat to see. I've only ever worked at a part of a process of the facility, so it was really neat to see from start to finish how that works. Every construction phase, you have phase one through four, and that's the engineering phase and figuring out what you're going to build. With Bluebeam, it's really like the overlay of the maps and things like that, and it really comes down to the overall design. And when you're laying over into a site like we are now, you mark everything up. That's where we share it across all the engineers, the plan, and then our construction team. And we pull up the prints and then we mark them out on how it's going, like any changes we have or things like that. Bluebeam, I mean, really, it's a huge communicator for us. Like if an engineer has a last minute change on a drawing, then we'll send it to the engineers on the project. They'll mark it up and make the changes on the drawing and send it back to us. And then we'll use it out in the field. We'll work over it with the foremans and the project managers. And we're dealing with people from all over the world. So we're sharing them on Bluebeam and you know, you communicate on that and you see what somebody else does. You get, give them a call and you work on it together. So it really brings everybody together on building something at the end of the day. When the crews come in, they come in and they see their part and then they're moved on to the next part of the project or another project in another state and it's done. They don't get to see the finished project. So I always like to send them photos of look what you did, look where you're at, you know what I mean? Like look what you did for these people and I'll send a picture of them, everything from start to finish. So that makes a big difference I think to them to show that I care. I keep in contact with every person I've ever worked with. Once the project's complete, I'm ready to go. Like honestly, on the next night, it feels amazing. I want to empower people to do that, like give them the courage to keep going. That's honestly the most important thing to me.